You cannot record. Why are you recording? What's that? Why are you recording? You cannot record. Who said that? Please turn it off. No, sir. Turn it off. Don't touch my camera. Turn it off. Don't touch my camera. Don't, don't, you don't touch, touch me. my camera. Don't you touch me. Stay off of me. That? Don't touch my camera. Call the police if you got a problem. Yes. Go ahead. This is private. Pro this is public property no, right here. Private property. You can voice your opinion. You can voice your okay, concern. You need to move. You need I'm to not going to move. You need to move. I'm not going to move. You need to move. If you touch me, I will fucking knock you out, brother. Oh, my friend. You, you, you I don't want to do that. I'm a peaceful guy. Come in peace. No, don't get not. the wrong idea. You're not a peaceful guy. Whenever you just turn around and you just go back. How would you like it if I came I and stuck my face, my hand in your face? Yeah, I'm just putting on the camera. Huh? Why are you recording in the first place, man? I'm working on the stories. No. What? Doesn't matter what I'm working on. It's my business. Keep out of my business. I'll keep out of yours. Hip no, sir. Yes, HIPAA. So let me tell you. Let me explain something. Since you said that, HIPAA law only applies to those that are trained in it. The onus falls on you to protect any confidential information, not me. You're still on hospital. No, sir. I have a GIS survey report. This is public right here. This is all of this. So oh, I, can public, I can prove it to you, right? The public place is this the bench over there. No, but he is private property. Awesome. Regardless of how they made it for it, this is still public access. I can prove it to you right now if, you, if you're interested in learning. I don't care. Honestly. If you look at the signs right over here on all these signs, there are signs that say City of San Jose. <laughs> this is public property. I can, I can move wherever I want. You can't tell me where to move. move. What are you fucking you talking about, bro? Please move. You can't tell me where to fucking stand. Are you kidding me? Sure. This is private property. You, you might want to call one of your supervisors. What? I'm the supervisor. Hold on. Let me, let me get your name there. Don't touch my camera. I'm going to fucking... Watch your don't mouth. do anything, bro. Watch your mouth. I will spray you right now. And over here on Hospital Parkway, one thing I want to point out, even though there's a hospital property right here, there's hospital property on the other side. When you look on the GIS map, this sidewalk and street is public. Another indication, if you're ever out auditing, check this out. See that sticker right there? City of San Jose. Meaning, it belongs to us, the people, guys. So this is definitely public access or public property. Let's continue. All right, guys. So basically, this is a follow-up First Amendment audit. If you remember, I was here a little over a year ago um, doing a night audit. And the security came out and was under the impression that the public sidewalk and street belonged to Kaiser Permanente. Don't get me wrong, they do have property on both sides of the street, but the street itself and the sidewalk itself belongs to us, the people. When I conducted that First Amendment audit a little over a year ago, the police did come out and educate them. However, let's see if they retain that information. Let's continue. All right, guys, just got done taking a little break, stretching my back. Um, still kind of sore, not going to lie. Um... But yeah, let's continue. I'm already getting out of breath just because the pain is kind of uh, it's hurting my lower back, guys. But I'm not here to get any of the patients just trying to do their thing. I'm just a guy with a camera going to peacefully record. See, we got the little security office right there. Comes a couple of the hospital staff. I hope they're going to jaywalk. There's a crosswalk right there. Maybe they're paramedics. Hard to say. Could be security. She's mumbling something, guys. So you see that sign that says private property, no trespassing? That's actually just this driveway. That's not the actual street, guys. Just want to be really clear on that. You can see she's looking right over there. I hope we got a couple more of them coming out. Sir, you cannot record. Why are you recording? 
What's that? Why are you recording? You cannot record. Who said that? Please turn it off. No, sir. Turn it off. Don't touch my camera. Turn it off. Don't touch my camera. Don't, don't, you don't touch, touch me. my camera. Don't you touch me. Stay you off of me. That? Don't touch my camera. Call the police if you got a problem. Yeah. This is public property no, right here. private property. All right, guys. Under California self-defense laws, you have the right to stand your ground. You have a right to defend yourself. You do not have to retreat. However, there is no state law or statute that authorizes this right. Instead, it goes by case law and jury instructions which recognize the right of a person to use force in self-defense without first trying to run away or escape. Even if you're outside of your home in a public place like where I'm at, you have the right to stand your ground. Keep in mind, you have to believe that the immediate use of force is necessary to defend yourself against danger, and you should never use more force than is reasonably necessary to defend yourself against that danger. I know a lot of you are like, Anthony, why didn't you spray him? Why didn't you give him the sauce? At the moment, I did not deem it necessary to give him the sauce or to spray him. I feel smacking or pushing his hand away from my face and equipment was the proper amount of force needed at the moment. Don't get me wrong, I did have my hand on my pepper gel spray. You can see him looking down at it, and I think he realized he better calm down. Let's continue. Move, move when you approach me aggressively, I have a right to defend myself. No, you're not. I do not approach you don't me touch a fucking you. other person just for recording. You can voice move. your opinion. You can voice your concern. You need to move. You need I'm to not going to move. You need to move. I'm not going to move. You need to move. If you touch me, I will fucking knock you out, brother. Oh, my friend. You, 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 I don't want to do that. I'm a peaceful guy. Come in peace. No, don't get not. the wrong idea. You're not a peaceful guy. I'm just putting on the camera. Huh? Why are you recording in the first place, man? I'm working on the stories. No. What? Doesn't matter what I'm working on. It's my business. Keep out of my business. I'll keep out of yours. Hippo no, sir. Hippo so let me tell you. Let me explain something since you said that. HIPAA law only applies to those that are trained in it. The onus falls on you to protect any confidential information, not me. You're still on hospital. No, sir. I have a GIS survey report. This is public right here. This is all of this. So I, public, can I can prove it to you right now. The public place is this the bench over there. Right no, over here is private property. The Regardless of how they made it for it, this is still public access. I can prove it to you right now if, you, if you're interested in learning. I don't care. Honestly. If you look at the signs right over here on all these signs, there are signs that say City of San Jose. <laughs> this is public property. I can, I can move wherever I want. You can't tell me where to move. move. What are you fucking you talking about, bro? Please move. You can't tell me where to fucking stand. Are you kidding me? Sure. This is private property. You, you might want to call one of your supervisors. What? Well, I'm the supervisor. Hold on. Let me, let me get your name there. Don't touch my camera. I'm going to fucking... Watch your don't mouth. do anything, bro. Watch your mouth. I will spray you right now. You spray me and you're going to... If you touch me, I will. Not, that's not my goal. But if you try to get in my face or take my equipment or touch me, I have a right to defend myself. How would you like it if I put my hand right in your face? You'd take that as a sign of aggression. You guys would tackle me. Tell me, if I did that to you right now, you wouldn't tackle me? Come on, man. I wasn't bothering anyone. I'm just peacefully recording, not saying a word to anyone. So you've never seen someone working on a story? You've never watched the news? No, but... You've never seen the news? Well, your security, your security. I'm telling you that we don't want you to record us, period. Well, unfortunately, you're... That is it. Let me give you a word of advice. If you don't want to be recorded, don't approach the cameraman. But why are you recording on the first place? Yeah. No, sir. Go on to Santa Clara County GIS survey. This is all public access. You have the property on both sides. It's okay for someone to go to your house and record you outside your house? They could, I would think it's weird, but they could, though. But, what you, like, but this is not someone's you're house. You're being weird. No, this is not someone's house. I wouldn't go to your, if, even if I had your address, I wouldn't go to your house and bother you and your family. No, this is a public area. Come on, man. I'm not inside, though. I'm not recording, like, you know, you're public information. Or, That's weird. I'm not recording the public people. I'm recording you guys. To you, yeah. You're a security guard. So, but I'm not doing anything wrong. So you just became the story. You just became the story. But, like, for what? And this guy right here, as a supervisor, has a lot to learn. 
I'm just trying to do my job. Yeah. That's it. Well, I like the way you approach. You have a right to come over and ask questions. You have a right, even though, you know, a little bit hostile, but you have a right to ask questions and show concern. You can't go around, you know, that's, that's a threat. California is what you call a stand your ground state. Approaching someone that aggressively, I could have taken him down. I, that's not my goal, man. Property, no, sir. All right, guys, let me do a quick pause again just to zoom in so you can really understand where I was standing. I was standing on International Circle, kind of in the tip where that red arrow is. If you look at the yellow lines, they represent the property lines. There's multiple different streets that you can come in to go around this little circle. I mean, there's even a public library on the right side of this map where you have to go into that International Drive circle to get to the public library. However, where I was standing, Kaiser Permanente does own the property on the other side of the street where they have a parking garage and some other offices. So for some reason, they keep thinking that the street itself belongs to them. It doesn't. It's public property let's continue so i just showed you to try to show you the gis survey yeah now if i go down those stairs if i go down those stairs you guys have a right to say hey get out of here well this is public right here no like you were standing in the sidewalk just in the sidewalk i didn't go down the little ramp though because I, I can see the sign that says private property i respect that okay so you see those cameras you guys got cameras up there what's the difference if you guys recording me without my permission and me recording you i'm on public this street right here, whether even if the hospital paid for this, this is <laughs> this public. This is sanctioned by the hospital, dude. It might be sanctioned. This might be a crosswalk, but this, this. whether this they paid for it or not, it's still a public easement. The public's gonna pay for that. It's a public easement. They might have not paid for this right here. You guys probably made it so you can get back and forth from your little uh, parking lot, but I have a right to be here. Should have tell them that you got aggressive and you almost attacked me. That you put your hand probably inches in my face. Falsifying a police report is a crime. And just so you know, I'm going to do a FOIA request. If you're calling the police, your phone that you do, you shouldn't call on your phone because that's public record now. I'm going to get his phone number as well now. Seeming like a stalker, man. Yeah, that's so a stalker who you guys approached me. I didn't approach you, but I'm the stalker, right? I'm going to be doing a FOIA request on everything you said in that conversation. If it's to the police, this is public property though. Seriously, educate yourself for the future in case someone else comes out here. You guys just don't want to listen. You guys just want to talk and not listen. Sounds like you guys aren't willing to be educated. And if you don't want to be recorded, don't approach me. You don't get my attention if you don't want to be recorded. I was crossing the street. You were recording. Yeah, I'm working on the story. You're part of it now. Well, look at him. He's crossing the street. Yeah, he's a, he's a civilian though. I'm not I'm not interested in him. We're civilians too. We just got jobs. You're security guards who are harassing me. That's why you're my story. Harassing. So you don't call three security guards putting their hand and one of them putting their hands in my face, almost touching me, approaching me aggressively. You don't call that harassment. If I would have done that to you, you would have called the police. And if you had it recorded, I would have been in cuss. Obviously, if someone's recording you for crossing the street, come on, guys. It's just a camera. I come in peace. I don't mean any ill will to anyone here. I'm a nice guy until you started getting crazy. You need some de-escalation training. You need de-escalation training. You never approach a citizen like that, brother. Can you believe this clown? Seriously, my brother, get some de-escalation courses, man. Learn how to approach people. Nothing wrong with you approaching me. But don't do it aggressively, man. That's not that's not smart. It's not nice either, man. It's not nice. I would never do that to you. Treat your fellow man as you would want to be treated. And Karen, if you don't want to be recorded, don't hang out in front of me. Karen, Darren, and Darren. And if the office, if the security uh, tyrant guy here, supervisor who needs retraining. Um, did call the police. We are going to do a FOIA request on the phone call, on the actual conversation. And we're going to make sure he didn't falsify any reports. If he did, we're going to be pressing charges. Filing a pl false police report is a crime. So make sure you told them how you approach me aggressively when they come. Be honest. Be a man. Step to the plate. Admit what you did. Move forward. That's all I can say. So they're trying to say this public easement, which is public, that's why it's called a public easement, is private. 
I tried to show them the GIS survey report from the county assessor's office and they don't want to see it. They just want to believe it's their way or the highway. Well, in this situation, it's my way, guys. All right, let's cross the street. Let's go check out their security office. So that's their little security office, guys. Trying to tell me the public easement is private. I mean, we got public transportation here. This is a public road. I've already been through this once before. Obviously, they haven't learned. They didn't put out a memo uh, informing their staff that um, this is public or anything. Yeah, they need a lot of training, guys. And honestly, that supervisor, he needs to be uh, re-trained. He needs to get some de-escalation courses. I have no problem with him approaching me, but when you approach that aggressively, putting your hand right in my face, rushing towards me, I don't know what you're gonna do. I have a right to push him back. He kept on advancing, walking towards me, forcing me to step backwards unless he was gonna touch me. So when I did that, I had to step uh, backwards. Very unprofessional. We will be making a complaint to their corporate. I don't know if she's a supervisor or just a regular staff. The guy right there in the blue with the mask, um, he was very nice. He threw me up a peace sign. If the police do come, we'll go from there. We'll see if the police get a pass. That's one of the reasons I do other types of uh, places other than government buildings or police stations. I wanna see if the police are called. How do the police handle it? Do they educate them or do they violate my rights? Like I said, this is public property. I have a right to be here. They can't apply HIPAA laws to a citizen on a public sidewalk. I wasn't trained in HIPAA. All I know is that the onus falls on them to provide that privacy. If they don't want people seeing what they're doing outside, take it inside. It's that simple. This is also a public hospital. I could even walk on the hospital grounds until they tell me not to. But I'm not here for that, guys. I'm just a guy with a camera peacefully recording.